the beginning of President Trump's uh, presidency, this is the easy part. Uh, these strikes were, were easy. Uh, the strike in Syria didn't change the military balance in that conflict at all. Dropping this one large bomb in Afghanistan didn't change the conflict there at all. In fact, General Nicholson, the Queen of Afghanistan, wants several thousand more U.S. troops, advisors in Afghanistan. And then what is the strategy in North Korea? Um, you know, as we talked about in the last segment, I think the key is China. Um, there's got to be a way for China to put more leverage on uh, Kim Jong-un and the North Korean uh, economy. That's the only sort of leverage that's left at this point. And if you could somehow get the Chinese frustrated with North Korea as they even ignore pressure from China itself, that would be a step forward. But in terms of a military solution, you know, you could bomb uh, a preemptive strike and, and take out some of these long-range missiles and the nuclear facilities but that would unleash a conventional conflict that could kill tens of thousands of South Korean civilians and thousands of American troops that are very close to the border. All right. Well, uh, I, you know, having spent time, as they say there, uh, military officials told me that within the first hour in a Korean conflict, 10,000 people would die, most of them civilians. David Rowe, thank you very much. Selena Zito and David Swerdling, stay with us because you will be coming back. Still ahead, tax day.